Hey guys, what's up? It's me TLG, and how are you guys doing? Today we're gonna do another Minecraft tutorial. Um, I think this is gonna be season 2, the first season was on Feed the Beast. But anyway, let's get started. Okay, so this Minecraft tutorial will be about how to make Eternal Day. Uh, this just takes a little bit of redstone and a cheated block. So, you need a daylight sensor first, so we can check if it's there or not. Then you need a stone brick and two redstone plates like this. And then a redstone torch so it gets cancelled, another piece of redstone, and the command block. And this will get you your daylight sensor. In the command block you need to type t times time set, set 500. Well, I prefer 500, you can do 0, it works the same way. So, well, that will do. Then, if you don't know how to get a command block, I'm just gonna tell you. You do t slash uh, give l, and if you don't know either, you can complete the name of a person if it's too long while pressing tab. You can press tab when you're like writing the first part, and it will identify it. If it if you're on a server and that's not the name, you can press tab again and again until it shows the name. Okay, give elephant smoothie. 137. 137 is the block ID for the command block. And then you can do like 8, and it will give you 8, as you see. Okay, so that is our daylight. Now let me time set night. So you can see it's last time set 13,000. Okay, so I'm just gonna wait until it's it goes really dark, so you guys can see. As you see, the daylight sensor is sending less and less of a uh, energy, and now this is barely getting energy. It will activate the redstone torch that will activate this piece of redstone and activate the command block. So let's just wait and see. Ah. Uh. Sorry for the waning. There we go. As you saw, it activated, it turned it on, set time to 500, and it worked. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and expect the next tutorial soon. Bye.